Here's meteorologist Michelle Muscatello with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. After a rough start with the weather Sunday for the tournament there, Rhode Island Country Club, it's been a couple of perfect days for golf, and we'll finish out the tournament today with another nice one. Our threat tracker is in the low category for today and tonight. Wednesday, we're bumping that up to the medium category, and the reason why we're tracking the possibility of some strong storms, gusty winds, hail, brief downpours, and any storms that do uh, fire up in and around our area for tomorrow. We're going to talk more about the timing of that. Heading out today, though, making your way down to the beach, perhaps. Beautiful day for Narragansett. It's mostly sunny skies, and that extends all the way up into the upper reaches of the bay here in Providence. 65 now, mostly mid 60s temperatures. Now, Newport started off the morning with a little bit of patchy fog. That's now giving way to brighter skies. Winds from the south, a light at three miles an hour. We're going to keep more of a south and southwest wind direction for today and bring in the warmer temperatures, but also keep the coast cooler compared to inland spots. Radar is quiet all across Rhode Island and in southeastern Massachusetts. So if you're headed out to Barrington today, we're looking at a beautiful day. Temperatures will be up around 80 degrees uh, in Barrington. Satellite and radar showing clouds, showers, thunderstorms to our west. That system does not make its way into our area until very late tonight and tomorrow morning. So out ahead of it, humidity will climb. The temperatures will be a little warmer. There may be an isolated shower central and western Massachusetts or Connecticut, but not around here. Around here, it's well after midnight. In fact, even more towards tomorrow morning that we start to see scattered showers and thunder. So a couple of rounds of showers or thunderstorms possible in the first part of the day tomorrow. Then I think we get a little bit of a lull. So here we are at four o'clock. Notice there's still a few showers off to our north and west. May catch one more that tries to slip through here in the evening. Most of the activity again happens before two or three o'clock in the afternoon tomorrow. As for today, two, three o'clock, we're in the low 80s with sunshine, Central Falls, Pawtucket 81 downtown and on the east side. Here's that forecast for Barrington about 80 degrees, Riverside at 81, at the airport about 81. At the coast, you're going to be in the 70s, but a beautiful day. Souther southerly winds in the middle 70s, Newport and Charlestown near 76, Block Island today near 75. And keep in mind there's a moderate risk for rip currents at the beach, Hope Valley near 80 degrees, Northwest Rhode Island, you're in the low 80s, warmer should say dry and partly sunny at about 81 in Johnston. Southeastern Massachusetts, 79 New Bedford, 80 Fall River, 81 in Seekonk. Taking a look at that seven day future cast, low 80s today. Get a little hit with the extra clouds, the showers and storms around for tomorrow. In terms of the chance of rainfall, 60% uh, chance in the morning. That drops down by 3 o'clock to about a 30% chance of a shower or a thunderstorm. Thursday, could see a shower around. Doesn't look like a washout near 80 degrees. How about the weekend? Right now looking dry for Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Got to watch an offshore storm system for the 4th of July. Right now, our computer models are keeping that to the south of us. So looking dry.